If you really want to know who a man is, take a look at how he treats his partner, his wife, his girlfriend. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. If you are new here, hello and welcome. My name is Ola Jumoke. So today I wanted to talk to you about relationships, specifically how to tell if a man really loves you and wants to be with you. Now I'm not talking about the initial stages of a relationship whereby you might have a very shy uh, gentleman who, you know, would really love to woo you but is still quite shy as to how to approach you or perhaps how to chase you. I'm talking about a situation where you've been dating your partner for a few months or a few years, you are quite ready to move forward but you're still in doubt as to where he might be situated. So today you think, oh he loves me and I'm sure and certain of it. Tomorrow you're thinking, mm, I'm not too sure. Um, you keep second guessing how this individual feels about you. So here are a few pointers to help you indeed decide whether or not it's worth staying and sticking it out or whether it's time to move forward. Number one, the very fact that you are doubting and perhaps uncertain as to how this individual feels towards you is a red flag. A man who loves you who genuinely loves you will leave you in no doubt as to how he feels. In fact, they treat it like a military operation to ensure that every day you have no uncertainties concerning their feeling. The second point is that if a man loves you, he makes you feel very safe with him. What I mean by that is that you can be authentically yourself. You can be vulnerable. You can be, um, you know, just genuinely who you are. You don't have to put on a facade. You don't have to pretend with him. He's seen you in your most vulnerable state, in your worst state, and still loves you and cherishes you and makes you feel like the best thing he's ever come across. The third point is a man who loves you will never make you work hard for his attention, his affection or his love. You don't have to you know, do anything extra. He just loves you for who you are inside and outside. Um, I find it very sort of jarring when I see ladies who put in the extra, extra effort, who have to work really you know, aggressively to show a man that uh, you know, she's there for him or indeed to buy a man's affection. A man who loves you will never put you through the ringer like that. It's just so obvious. His love is clear by the things he does. I'm not necessarily saying public display of affection. That's all very lovely and very well, very good. I'm talking about the little things. Does he put you first? Do you feel like you are his priority? Love is patient, love is kind, love is mature. Does he flare up at the slightest thing? Does he make you feel like nothing you do will ever be good enough for him? If he does, then he most likely does not love you. Because guess what? There will be another woman out there that he treats excellently, that he treats like a queen. So if he treats you like trash and he treats someone else better than he treats you, then he most likely does not love you. If a man loves you, he's patient with you. He's tolerant, he's kind, just basic kindness. If a man loves you, he's not hitting you, he's not putting you down. You know, do you feel that regardless of what happens in your life, this person has staying power and they will never leave you no matter what happens? You know, can you rest in them? I don't mean, you know, putting your life in someone's hands, but in, to a certain degree, yes. How confident are you that if you hit rock bottom, for instance, if you lost everything, they would still stay with you. They would be there for you. Would he love you regardless of what happens? That in itself is a true reflection as to whether or not a man loves you. And if you've been dating an individual for an extended period of time, these are things that you ought to know. It's obvious with the way he um, approaches situations. The next point is he will treat you as part of his future. So when he talks about his future, does he talk about the things that he wants to do, you know, where his career is moving to, the kind of place that he would like to live, the kind of family that he wants to have? Or does he speak about you as a partnership? So does he include you in his plans? Have you actually talked about marriage, if that's what you want? Um, I find that, you know, most times 
women make the mistake of assuming that a man can read their minds sometimes you actually have to be very uh, clear if you've been dating someone for a few years you at that point ought to know where it's headed so maybe it's time to have that conversation with him but i digress slightly coming back to the point are you a significant part and fixture in his future when he has conversations with you that's a very clear pointer as to whether someone sees their future with you and whether or not they actually want to love you for the rest of their lives and yours the next pointer is does he speak about you in public you know is he very proud to speak about you is he constantly thinking about you uh, do people around him know about you that is so important my goodness if other women are not sure whether a man is single or in a relationship that is a clear sign that he probably doesn't love you or he might be using you in the meantime to move on to something else when the time comes so I think how other people see you through his eyes is a clear and sure sign as to whether a man really loves you or whether he's just using you until the next best thing comes along. The next thing is if a man loves you, you won't have to make excuses for him. If a man hits you, ladies, that is unacceptable, but let's, let's keep it quite lighthearted here. I'll give you an example. If you have a date planned and he turns up three hours late or doesn't reach out to check in with you, in my opinion, that is a very clear sign that he does not respect you. And most ladies would make excuses for him, you know, oh, he's so busy at work, you know, he's just overwhelmed. Look, if that was a three to five million dollar contract do you think he'd actually show up yes he would so don't make excuses for a man if a man loves you you're his priority he's constantly thinking about how to please you and keep you safe and happy ladies i think it's high time we stop making excuses for men and just accept them at face value some men are fantastic at pretending to be what they're not with other women but i have a theory if you really want to know who a man is, take a look at how he treats his partner, his wife, his girlfriend. That's who a man genuinely is. So that's it for this video. I hope you found this very useful. Please don't forget to comment, please share and subscribe. I'd love to hear from you and I shall see you in my next video. Until then, bye for now.